funky. Hi! Latest issue of Cosmopolitan. Look at that, look at that. I like your boobies. Your best sex ever? Well, what is your idea of best sex ever? So, um, I was looking for this magazine, this shoe at Target, which I like that color, but I don't really like to wear heels. I am fun size. Got these at Target, and these are lately my so far, thus far, favorite shoes ever. I literally plowed through the woman looking at my size, and I was like, girl, ain't nothing gonna fix that yeti feet. So I wanted to do a video on uh, my favorite drugstore products, or actually, the best drugstore products I've ever had, when it's the best thing you've ever had. You keep coming back. Okay, so I'm gonna go on with this video really quickly because it is a lot. I'm not gonna sit here, show you the product for like 10 minutes and be like, ah, yeah, I was walking at the store and I saw this girl and I was like, ah, yeah. All this, stop video making advice. Um, I'm gonna go through this just randomly. Sonia Kashuk Primer, oh my god. Right now it's getting a little warm, our pits are starting to get sweaty, and having an oily face is just Disgust. Well, I don't like to have an oily face. And it makes your makeup look like you just need one layer, girl. So I'm a very big... She's barking downstairs trying to protect her cookie. Like, literally. I don't know why she just doesn't want to eat her cookie. Poor. I'm going to show you guys some hand products that I love. Burt's Bees Hand Salt. It makes me look like I have grandma hands. Like, you know, silky. Thank you, Fama. Doesn't this guy look like a rapist to you? The worst thing is to have ashy hands. And you don't want to pull a Kenya more, you know? Ashy. Ashy. So another one of my favorite is a Vitalizing Cocoa. Co There's something about cocoa that you just don't know, no. I hardly use lotion anymore. I just use a body gel this stuff is like the wonder under bra I don't know how you work but you damn look good Palmer's cocoa butter heals and softens rough dry skin it smooths your stretch marks and tones your skin and I know you guys are gonna be like you don't have stretch marks blah 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 oh yes I do God, it's cheese but that's my insecurity you know this is not a product that will like work in a day and you look in the mirror and be like oh I don't know why but I like ethnic hair I hate when I'm driving in my car and I don't know where that siren is coming from. And I hate it when they come up through an intersection. My tip is just flower it. <laughs> so anyways, um, ethnic hair. I think ethnic hair is one of the most beautiful hairs out there. Next to your blonde and next to your gingers. This one is the Fantasia Hair Polister. Polisher, heat protector and straightening serum. Now I don't use straightening serums because my hair is pretty straight But when the LA humidity starts to come on, it's not the fro I want to rock So the bottle looks like this and it straightens shines and protects I put this in my hair when it's damp. I don't put a lot just put as much as your long cocaine fingers and I just blow dry it and it gives you the ultimate shine but I love to use this because it's a serum for hot tools so for those of you ladies who's married to your hot tools I recommend Fantasia because unlike a tool you're not gonna do me wrong I had a tool for a boyfriend he was a dick don't ever date tools they're dicks big ones not in a good way another one of my favorite blow drying tools is my big sexy blow dry volumizing gel this shit is the bomb all I do is I take a little dime, I just lather it in the tips and the roots, and blow dry your hair down. The results will just be... You know, looking for a good mascara is just really hard to find because it's like looking for a good man. My eyelashes are just long, naturally, but they're not full. So this one is the False Fiber Lashes. If you guys have ever tried this one, it's the Power Volume Collagen in these two. I put this on first, and I just build the volume with this. Oh my lord. Like, I like my lashes kind of clumpy. Like, to me, it's kind of sexy. And I know some of you guys thinking like, Oh, why? Uh, cause... I don't know, everybody has a preference, you know? But I sure as hell will never give up on my Clinique because this stuff works so awesome on your bottoms. Okay, so my favorite nail polish color in the whole entire world is red. I got my three shades of red right here. This one is by Orly called Hot Oat Oat Red. Oat Oat Red. <laughs> This next one is by my favorite Kardashian. This one is called Court is Ready for a Petty. Sexy on your toes. It doesn't pop like this one, you know, like And this one is from the Winter Collection from Essie called Snap Happy. And on top of all that, I think the best, um, besides my out the door stuff, this Gloucester by Orly is the pop. Okay, my last and favorite thing. It's not a drugstore, but I did find one at CVS one day. It's one of these tummy tuckers, they're booty shorts. When you wear like dresses and you just want your booty to pop, the only thing you want popping out when you wear something is your butt 
or your titties. Not the belly. We don't have time for our fupa here. Okay, so this stuff is a waist cincher and it also, it, it flattens your stomach. And I know I don't really need a spanky, but something about spanks just kind of tight places it needs to. So yeah, ladies, check up on your cocoa butter. So, you know, the next time a girl calls you out for being jealous, you say, Jealous of cottage cheese? Merry Christmas. All right, you guys, I'm gonna go get some sushi. We'll see you for my Tuesday video. We are gonna be talking about jealousy because this is a disease that most of us girls have. And some of us just have a worse case of it. So if you guys want my two cents on it, say yeah. I gotta go feed my children some biscuits. They're all behind my door, pissed. I'm coming. God, that's all you like me for. Okay, bye.